This single European currency is depreciating. Paired with the dollar, the euro has um, descended to its uh, three months low as investors uh, harbor doubts regarding the European Central Bank's ability to sustain its monetary policy tightening. The Eurozone's producer price index was expected to decrease from a minus 3.4 to minus 7.8 percent, indicating a sharp inflation slowdown and, consequently, a potential halt in the European Central Bank's monetary policy tightening. However, the recent preliminary inflation data hinted uh, at um, deviations uh, from the forecasts. To some extent, this proved accurate. Producer price declines accelerated to a 14-year low of minus 7.6%. So the latest inflation data merely demonstrated that consumer prices do not immediately react to producer price changes. In other words, inflation in Europe is inevitably set to decline and quite rapidly. On the one hand, this is of course positive news, and from the market's perspective, however, this um, signifies that the European Central Bank will clearly exercise caution in a further raising interest rates. And if the situation remains unchanged, there is a possibility that the idea of rate hikes could be shelved for the foreseeable future, particularly in Europe. This scenario is quite favorable for the dollar, so it immediately started rising vigorously. Considering the pace of its ascent, it's entirely plausible that a minor pullback could occur during the American trading session. As seen on the charts, the euro against the US dollar slowed down its recovery phase around the level of 1.0800. And this is where traders stopped buying the euro, which led to a new downturn in the exchange rate. The euro-dollar pair has some hit a fresh swing low, as regularly noted by one of our viewers, who remarks that the chart is a trend towards parity. Sustained downtrend below 1.0750 permit subsequent rise in euro sell trades. As for an alternative scenario, the quote would initially need to break levels above 1.0800. Only after this move we could speak about the possibility of the downtrend reversal. The British pound against the US dollar has marginally recovered positions previously lost following the recent downward rally. Still, there, is, um, there are no radical changes as we are witnessing the descending cycle that originated back in July. Declines may continue if the price holds below the level of 1.2550, otherwise the potential rises for a sideways ampli amplitude around the existing base. And that's all for now. We keep monitoring the financial market situation. Subscribe to our channel and see you in several hours. We will take a close look at the used trading session.